Earlier this week, I stumbled upon a limitation within the assert sent method of the mail facade. Now, what I was doing was testing that a review shift, or in this case, a review shift email, was sent out to users that recently ran some of the newer shifts. And I was using a callback to assert that the properties of their order matched what I expected in my test. And this tested multiple of those uh, being sent. So it's pretty common to actually use these PHP unit assertion methods directly in here to provide a little bit better of an error message. But in doing so, I ran into that limitation. So let me run the test real quick to demonstrate that this fails. Now, the code actually is running correctly, but this test is the problem because of the limitation. Now, we can see this a little bit more in action by digging deeper into core and looking at this assert sent method particularly when a callback is sent, it's actually asserting that a certain number of these mailables matched, or in this case, it found a mailable matching those specific callback criteria. But if we look even deeper into this sent method, we'll see that the way it does that is it first matches the mailable instance type and then filter those by actually calling the callback. And herein lies the limitation. Because of the filtering, the expectation from Laravel is that the callback will return true or false and therefore allow it to be filtered. But because of these PHP unit assertions, that's not happening. So I needed to actually condense this back to the recommended way of simply returning a condition that meets those same criteria and not using the PHP unit assertions. When I run this test again, we'll see everything passes. So while I like to use those assertions to provide more expressive failure messages, in this case where I'm setting up multiple assert sent callbacks, I'm actually not able to do that and need to honor the original way Laravel expects these callbacks to behave.